All I gotta do is put my mind Stop it! You're gonna make it a stereotype. <laughs> you are wild up. Shut up! <laughs> What's good, Duffy Gang? It's your boy Tyler the Duff, and I am back with another, I don't know what I'm doing, video. Hit the subscribe button if you are new. Like this video. <laughs> and comment, right? <laughs> comment and subscribe and all that. Yeah, I'm Today, y'all, today's video is gonna be about addressing gay and black stereotypes. I asked you guys on Instagram to submit stereotypes that y'all want us to address and what our opinions is in the video. So I'll be reading them. So not all black people like Kool-Aid and fried chicken. That is very true. Y'all, yeah. I don't like chicken that much. It really doesn't. I like the outer layer of the chicken, like the best part, and I don't even like getting down to the bone because it's just like, there's no more flavor. This is just meat. This is just, oof. Veins and there. I'm just <laughs> Kool Aid only tastes good if you dump a whole bunch of sugar into it. Yeah, yeah. Kool Aid is an art, really. We want every straight guy we meet. Oh, straight people be thinking that just because you like the same that we want them. Nobody wants your ugly, crusty, five foot one, mm. no dick having that mm. small feet, ugly, mm. you know, everything looking. So we don't want you. There are straight people that we would see that would be attractive and it'd be like, damn, you know what? We can't have them. But that's it, end of story. Every straight person thinks that every gay people's gonna yeah. like them. I hate the fact that they don't. have to announce it in, yeah. the, in the beginning of everything and it's just everything. like, why are you announcing it? Don't feel flattered like, about yourself. You're f***ing ugly. Like, ain't nobody looking at you like that. You look ugly. Trust me, <laughs> looking at you, boo boo boo. You don't look or act gay. I would say that I've definitely seen some people who dress and act and then they're not, apparently. That's their life. I've definitely seen a lot that have proven me wrong. That, yeah, that's very true. A lot of straight men act like gay people and a lot of gay people act like straight people. So yep. there really I is no literally, I literally watched a video on YouTube about the people trying to find, there was eight guys and they had one gay guy in the room and they had to try and figure it out. The gay guy lasted a long time without them even figuring out yes. who the gay guy was. It's not that easy. Really? It's not not that, that easy. <laughs> when somebody says, all I, I, oh, when somebody says, I don't want to date a black girl, all black girls have attitudes. I hate that. I okay. hate it so much. It, it, that is just like, come on now. That's, they say that with Latino women. Say it with Latino women? Yeah, they say girl, they got attitudes. They don't, you know. Every girl that has been hurt has an attitude, no matter what yes. race that you go to. It don't matter what. So, mm -hmm. you will never even know that pretty girl that may act like this and act all calm once you start dating her and she cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. And you didn't know until you started dating her? Yeah, yeah, and then you find out like two months later how crazy the person is. Yes, so you can nip that in the butt right now. I don't like that. All black people like watermelon. I actually like watermelon with salt. I love watermelon. So good. Watermelon is good. Watermelon is good, but all black people don't like watermelon. I've definitely met a lot of people that don't like watermelon, mm -hmm. you know? But they, they also think watermelon is like their favorite fruit. It's not. I'm like, why can't we just like fruit? Like, what, yeah. what's wrong? Like, what if a, somebody that's white or somebody that's Hispanic? What's your favorite fruit? Mine's pineapples. I don't think I have a favorite fruit. I just like fruit. I don't really have one that I like to be like, I'm craving it. If so, it would be watermelon with salt. <laughs> <laughs> Gay people try to go around and fuck everyone in the world. False. False. Because Everybody's it's been proven that even straight men have just as many partners as gay men. But the only issue is, is that gay men have to be a little bit more cautious due to, you know, the diseases that fly around. But straight yeah. men have the equal amount of partners, but they're with women and guys more so are with guys. So that's false. And even when it comes down to diseases, straight men, straight women can get those diseases just as equal. Yep. There's never no difference. There's no gay people get diseases more. No, it's about practicing safe sex. Wrap it up. I mean, wrap it up. Wrap it up, bitch. Wrap it up. Wrap or just stop up. being a uh, you know what. Wrap it up. Gay people always like their male friends. Ugh. No, Ugh. Not really. Most of my male friends were ugly as hell. So no. Don't and be mean, then, but they are all ugly. Most of them are ugly as hell. So yeah, over the course but of my life. that should let you know that we don't find them attractive. <laughs> Uh, Period. Ugly <laughs> as hell, child. Assumption that straight guys with gay friends are down low. 
Yes. Having male friends is impossible. Yes. I hate that. I hate when yes. people think that whenever a straight guy is friends with a gay guy, then a straight guy must be gay. That's false. Why is it we're trying to advance? I farted. It's in the stink. But why can't we advance in society? <laughs> Damn. Why, why can't we advance in society? <laughs> Hey. Oh my god, the states! Baby, girl, what the <laughs> hell is going on in your guts today? That's oh. <laughs> fucking nasty. <laughs> but yeah, we're trying to advance in a society where everybody can live in harmony, but if we keep on knocking each other down saying, oh, you must be gay, you yes. like hanging out with that Like, for like, example, every time we have somebody on our, on our channel and we tell them they're straight, they all say, what did y'all say? They're down low. They might I be believe down they're low. down low. Like, can y'all, what the hell? Just because you want them doesn't mean that they are. Stop exactly. doing that. Exactly. So for y'all out there, especially you people that like to save stop trying, stop pulling a James Charles, trying Thank to convince you. straight people that they like you. Because you're part of the problem At the end of the, the day, the gay well. community know what they be doing when they be trying to manipulate straight men too. You are just as equal as toxic masculinity mm -hmm. within the male community because, look. Fix your mindset and fix yourself. What happened to the okay. respect of everything? Everything is just out of whack. Ain't nobody being paid. Because last I checked, it's just mind your business, stay in your lane. Like, what do you need to talk extra for? Just be happy, enjoy your life, enjoy the people that are around you. What does in the bed, in private time have to do with you? Period. Black people stay ready to go the fuck off. Not all of them. Not all. No, but whenever it's time. For it's me, Tom. personally, it's Tom, bitch. <laughs> but that also goes to, like, what black people have been through. That if you are well-known, you date outside of your race. You what? That's a thing. Wait, what? If you are well- That if you are well-known, you date outside of your race. If you are well-known, you date outside of your race. I don't race. think that's a real one. Yeah, I, I think, think you have so. the free will to date what you choose. There's, there's just a lot of people. Who... That is. That's just weird. Anyways. <laughs> All gay people are feminine or punks. I mean, you can catch these hands to find out if we are. I was so like, like, I know a lot of, uh, like a few coworkers at my job, they'll sit there and say, I'm afraid of gay people because back when they were younger, they got bullied and shit, so they don't tolerate that now. And it's an equal fight. There is no difference between being straight or gay. Because it's just, yeah, why would we be older and tolerate that? Like, you don't pay my bills. Yeah. Who are you talking to like that? I'm grown. Yeah. Because if somebody was talking to you like that, you would not like it. You just gotta be civil. What? You look like you seen one nose retarded? I was like, if you don't dress girly, people automatically assume you're a stud. It's so damn annoying. Okay, so look. Uh, that, I see what they mean. So like, a stud. So you know how like sometimes like in the gay community they call like really nice looking men studs? So is this for like women? Because I know like now the lesbian side has adopted the term stud. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, what is this specifically? If you don't dress girly, people automatically assume that you're a stud. Are you a female? Oh yeah, you are a female. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, sorry. Um, if you don't dress girly, people automatically assume you're a stud. Yeah. It's so damn annoying. Why can't you just dress the way that you want to dress? It's weird, I, I don't know. Like if it's winter that. time, you expect her to wear Uggs? All right. Or some boots that will actually keep her feet warm with common sense. I farted again. <laughs> My farts don't never stink, y'all. This is Tyler. This is something ah! different. This is something different. I don't know what happened. Ah! I don't know what's going. Oh! Look, even Russ is like, oh! <laughs> this is crazy. Uh, uh, uh. um, stink booty. Gay. <laughs> The gay men, especially black men, all have an S. You know, out of all my all my straight friends have literally caught an S or STI before. I have never caught anything. Right. Ever. And i I have to say I had I had a lot of partners. Not partners. Just I've had a lot of you know, I explored my sexuality a lot. So I've definitely done that and I've never caught anything. Wrap it up, make sure that you Get some. I, I used to get receipts. I needed to see that you've been testing that you're clean because I didn't play that. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. But that's false because there's a lot of people out there that are very safe. Mm -hmm. So, why people have to believe that being gay is a sin? Like I said before, God knows 
your heart and knows your mind. That is a definite. That's not even a debate in the Bible. God has said that. There's a lot of debates that said, mankind that shall not lie with mankind. That, and people, people have been misinterpreted that and twisted and made it and manipulated their own type of way. Religion doesn't know a straight answer. We don't know a straight answer. All I know is that God knows my heart and knows my mind. Mm -hmm. So, But if you would stop listening to these pastors and actually read the Bible, because the pastors tell you what they've read and what they want to tell you. If you read the Bible yourself and find out God does not like ugly, point blank, period. We are a higher being than that. We are supposed to love and care for everybody, even if it's not your kids and you got kids, you see another kid crying, you're supposed to pick that kid up and make sure that kid stops crying because you love and care. But everybody got so ignorant. ignorant. They only care about their own kids ignorant. and their own life. It's it's even like, that, even if they do care about their own kids. Yes. <laughs> Still ignorant, period. It's ignorant. just like, you gotta, you gotta just read the Bible, understand that God never oh, said to hate. This period. one. If we touch or talk to a straight guy, we make them gay. I've heard of that ignorant stuff that came out of my mama's mouth before, actually, and my family. I didn't even know that was a thing. What's, is that a thing? I've never heard it's of that. It's not a what thing. I dap up homeboys all the time and everything like that and say, hey, if what's you up? Touch another, if, you, if you touch, you give them the game. I've heard of that ignorant stuff. I remember I twitched. So I'm like, what the fuck is that? And like, I, that doesn't even... Where's the logic in that? In the reality we live in, honestly, where is the logic? He, you gay now. What the fuck? <laughs> no, that all of us, bro. all of us want to be a woman. Oh my gosh! Why can't we just like the same sex and just be fine? But these things are true, though. I've heard these things. This video is making my head hurt. I'm about to just, I'm gonna wrap this up, y'all. Like this video, I may do a part two. Like this video, comment, subscribe if you're new, turn on the notification <laughs> bell. I'll let you know what you want to say.